Hi, it's another great day in Kansas. We're on Route 66. This is the original 1926 alignment coming from Riverton out to Baxter Springs. That way, here's the new bridge. This bridge here is called the Rainbow Curve Bridge. A lot of people just call it the Rainbow Bridge out here in uh, Brush Creek. Just down there. This is all Route 66 from 1923, actually, and then 1926 when Route 66 came by. Look at that. Rainbow Curve Bridge. It's the only remaining Marsh Arch Bridge on Route 66. It's on the National Register of Historic Places. That's cool. So they wanted to tear this down at one time when they built this bridge over here. So we got uh, this listed on the National Register of Historic Places. You can't tear it down anymore. So that's pretty cool. Anyway, there used to be another bridge even before that. Right down here, see that little concrete mumbo jumbo down there? That's the old abutment for the older, older bridge. It's out over there. Wow, so in 1923, we built this bridge here over our little brush creek. And the length of this bridge is 130 feet long. It's got these two beautiful concrete arches. Each one is 130 feet long. And the uh, width here of the bridge is pretty narrow. As you can see, so it's only good for one direction, headed westbound. It gets its name from the two concrete arches here by a guy named James Barney Marsh. He's an engineer and a bridge designer. He patented a new design for arch bridges in the early 1900s. That's what we call a Marsh Arch Bridge. So in 1992, they built the new Route 66 bridge over here, and I told you it's supposed to be demolished, but uh, we get to keep it. This is such a beautiful landmark. Hey, so here's the underside of the bridge. Just amazing. Look at that arch span. Wow, 130 feet wide. Can't go too far down here, but that's called Brush Creek down there. It's a beautiful bridge on old Route 66. And here, call that the new Route 66 bridge. That way. So the span here is 130 feet of archway, but the whole bridge itself is a tiny bit longer. Built in 1923, I mentioned. And, uh, you know, there's a little paint job, but other than that, it's beautiful. Down here is called Rush Creek. Right here, We've got a lot of tourists all coming through here, so it gets real noisy sometimes. And over here, I think there's a marker on the side of the bridge. Here we go. It's always fun to find these little markers here. From the Federal Aid Project, number 142, Board of County Commissioners. And way down here, well, you can't see it there, maybe there, you can see it, I don't know, 1923. It's part of the whole state highway expansion project throughout the states to get to the west coast, which was later, of course, Route 66. Pretty good standing, but you see these uh, cross beams here. It doesn't allow for high traffic, like military vehicles or bigger trucks. So that's why you got to build this type of steel bridge that doesn't have the trusses or the arches on top. That's pretty cool. So I'm glad to see our little bridge here is still in really good shape out here on Route 66. 
Anyway, Brad Paisley sang his song, Get Your Kicks on Route 66 here in the year 2000 as part of the Main Street America TLC special on uh, television. So you might remember that. You get a peek down below here too, a little bit. Anyway, there you go. That's our Rainbow Curve Bridge out here between Riverton and Baxter Springs. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked that video. Have a great day.